Hi, it's Alyssa from Online Fabric Store. Get rid of plastic wrap for good and cut down on waste with these beeswax wraps that are great for covering your leftovers. So let's get started. The materials you will need are cotton print fabric, a baking sheet, beeswax, I got mine from Valley View Acres, which is a local beekeeper, a pot with a double boiler, coconut oil, something to stir the mixture with, a paintbrush, pine resin. I collected mine from a tree in my backyard. Look it up if you want to collect your own or you can purchase it online. And pinking shears. Cut your beeswax up into small pieces. Bring water to a boil and put your pine resin and your beeswax inside the double boiler. It may take up to an hour to melt down, so be patient. Stir occasionally. When it is all melted together, put coconut oil in with your beeswax and resin. I am using a ratio of 10 parts beeswax to one part resin to one part coconut oil. Cut out pieces of fabric with pinking shears. Pinking shears help to stop fraying. I am cutting rectangles of varying sizes. Place your fabric onto a cookie sheet covered in tin foil or parchment paper. Paint the beeswax mixture onto your fabric. Put the cooking sheet into the oven at 200 degrees Fahrenheit for five minutes. Make sure that the wax is evenly distributed over your fabric by brushing it with the paintbrush again. Check to make sure that the wax has seeped into the other side of your fabric. If it is not, paint a little more wax on top and put it in the oven for another three minutes. Hang to dry for about a minute. And now, your beeswax wraps are complete. Beeswax wraps can be used for about a year if taken care of properly. Just wash them with cool water and a mild soap and hang them to dry. After about a year, you just reapply the wax and then they're good as new. Thanks for watching this OFS project. Like and subscribe to our channel for more crafting videos, tips, and tricks. See you next time.